No more rockets? Did the rocket fall? Or did I use it? <laughs> it's unclear. I don't know if it could have been shaken down. Also, this is the wrong material anyways. For calling down the iridium. Back to the numbers place. Yeah, heat is still... Well, we can take a look at how I would go about oxygen. That's just trees, though, right? Tree spreaders. Fertilizer, zeolite, super ally bacteria, tree bark. What else is using my zeolite? There's the gas extractor. There are the fusion cores, which we're trying to avoid using any more of. Thing is, we're about to get the next level of tree spreader, so we're just going to kind of ignore that. Algae is a free way of doing it. Flower spreader is also okay. But yeah, it's it's mostly trees. Trees well known as, you know, the thing. So. Honestly, I guess drills. More drills! Yeah. I have more drills. While we're waiting for the next level of tree spreader. Nope. <laughs> Three drills. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. To the drills. I assume I don't need any more green cores. Never assume. I didn't do a super alloy pickup, but I felt like I had enough. To the widow mines. Kind of creepy when they phase in like that. Very good. They like to scamper over each other. It's a classic drill move. Okay, I estimate these should be two thirds full. Let's see if my estimations are wrong. Or the timing is RNG as opposed... Uh, three quarters? Really? Hmm. Build more water. I'm doing my best. There's no water asteroids that I know of. Super alloy pickup. Silicon stonks are low. We'll get there. Just so far. It's a minute trip.
It's so bright out here. Why is it so bright inside if it's bright outside? Well, because it doesn't have the lighting all done yet. <laughs> so you get an idea. Even without windows, you need to know. Oops. Beautiful. Um. New subscriber. Two recline. Two recline is chilling for two months. I'm truly it. Mm -hmm. I just don't know. Mm. We're about. I don't know where that number came from, but it's like 79.6 is the number for the tier 3 tree spreader. I have no idea why that specific number, but... Probably some multiple of the other ones. Mm. Yeah, the FPS drops during the rain and in the supply depot pretty significantly. Almost there. Who would have thought? Okay. Oh yeah, we added the pressure. We're at two. What is it? Two four nine. Two four nine. Nine six seven five zero. creating records so this way I have a record of what it was and if it's changed this is the amount in the larger number that it's changing per second so at a relatively similar scale so this tells me that right now my heat is the lowest relative generate apparently the terraforming in index goes up the most efficiently I'm not sure if this is true, but it feels like it should be true if they're similar numbers and it benefits you for bringing them similar because I mean like you don't want to heat up the planet a bunch and have no oxygen. That's not good how that's not good for terraforming. So bringing the numbers in general line with each other as well as potential conversion rates. I'm still it doesn't tell you your terraforming rate I find it odd it doesn't tell you your GTI per second like I have to do the fucking math I have to time it um in fact I will we're gonna reset I'm gonna time it for for 
All right, point two. I'll time it for 30 seconds and double it. <laughs> Point one six, so point three two per minute. That's my current rate, and we can compare that. Insects are at seven point six seven percent. So if I'm at seventy nine point five, oh, which is the tree spreader. 9.5 times, okay, 100. Uh, uh, uh. 1,060. Fuck. Is your goal? My goal is number go up. Number go up faster. Just have these in case we need them. Can deconstruct and move them. Just take them out. Take a sign off the wall. Figure it out. <laughs> Believe it or not, complex life forms are harder than even plants. All right, T3 tree spreader is two fertilizer T2, one zeolite, super alloy, bacteria. I think we just dismantle. I don't know. I need to get more zeolite. A summary. I'm not, like, and you gotta find that out there. Give me a shout down vibe. Oh shit. But I made those signs, I didn't take them. They were, shut up. I have 51 more hours of current growth rate. That's not that bad. <laughs> Remember, I started today, like three hours ago at 30 GTA, so it's not too bad. I've done 40. Like, and it's getting exponentially higher. And we just unlocked the, the top thingy. Number one thingy. One ninety three. I need fertilizer T two. Because the first one only had T one. Let's do the science. Uh, methane to... I think we have three out there, so... Two, three... Where's my squash? I guess. I was sequencing something. 150 on the oxygens. 
I think it removes my trees. Yeah, I have four of them. But these have the best plants and they take zeolite. Inventory full. Oh yeah, I gotta take the plant out. Rip trees, but I don't think that actually, I, I think the trees are cosmetic, but I'm not, maybe it ramps up to it. I don't know. Two hundred percent. Wait, was that the T three? Yes. <laughs> and the trees just disappear. <laughs> Plus 25. Ah, so it does have to grow. So we'll have to check it after. Its radius is over water. Is it efficient? You know what? Okay, you got a good point. I'll build one that is in, like, the most ideal possible location, I think. With, like... All land, nowhere near any others. Like, I mean, this seems pretty close to it. I didn't put a plant in it. And then later on we'll compare it to these and see if there's a difference. I'll have to see. I need one more fertilizers. I need more zeolite. I've got ten tied up in fusion cores right now. I've got three or four in tree spreaders. Where else does it go? I've got a... I could break down the pulsar crystals I haven't used. That's the stuff. There. I got it. Squash. Because the pulsar crystals, I believe, mm, they go into the DNA manipulator. They go into... There's two in the gas extractor. And then there's five in each of the fusion cores. I'll put this one over here. Like, these, are, these are the end game. They should never be replaced unless they are... Not in an ideal location. These things. There's a multiplier number of rockets of each type. Well, I've given up on that. I've now just... I'm tracking how much each rocket gives relative... <laughs> 25 parts per trillion per second. I was advertised... Wait... It says 12,500 a second. So we'll see how that ends up. Let's see if there's a noticeable change yet. I think it affected it instantly. Oh my god. It doesn't... It seems like once you slap it down like the other... I would be kind of surprised if it was like a build-up. I think the trees are cosmetic <laughs> for now. Yeah, it's not going up, so... You can build them wherever you want trees, I think. So... <laughs> 
Oh, well, that's a significant increase. 866260. Interesting. And then seven. Yeah, over doubled. By just replacing them with the tier threes. Seven three seven seven two. So priority is replacing the fusion cores with nuclear reactors to free up the zeolite and also find more zeolite. But what is there? 36 you can get total. I got 10 in reactors. I got one in the DNA manipulator, so that's 11. I got two in the guest, so that's 13. I got four in the spreader, so that's 17. And then I think I have like two or three. I measure tarot rate? Not yet. So I've got 20 of what I believe is potentially 36. So the rest are out there. Hiding. Use four to make two of your crystals for the fusion core. Uh, do I have those pulsar crystals somewhere? I do, somewhere. That might be... I mean, I was counting the fusion core. Watch them be on the ground or shredded. I think that would be a huge... It's like one of the... Don't get rid of... Z At first, I thought it, like... Because it grows on plants, I thought it would just regrow. I didn't shred them. Okay. I didn't get rid of them. I don't get rid of anything. It's a problem. Um... I may have just turned into more for the, uh, another fusion core. I think that was it. Yeah, I don't really have any. Because I just may have added more for a second fusion core. Yeah, they'd be in here, I think. I right, hope. So I guess the priority is as we get further on to have renewable independent power as opposed to the static amount of fusion energy. Honestly, the gas extractor at some point is not necessary. We have 400... Yeah, I need to build more reactors. Super alloy, uranium rods. Alright. Alright, we need iridium to build more extractors on uranium. So on and so forth. Option two is try to call down asteroids and go into the asteroid based economy again, but.
It's literally faster to dump it on the ground than put in the shredder. Because the shredder does not do your entire inventory size. The idea is at some point I'll use all this for something. <laughs> Sometime. Building the trash well. No one said being a planet crafter was easy. We didn't become a planet crafter because it was easy. We became a planet crafter because we saw it as a preferable option to life imprisonment for a minor offense. runs which is enough to slap together another rocket engine to call down the meteors the basic uranium. Are you making more reactors? I want more iridium rods. In general. I need them for everything. They actually seem to be quite the choke point on this. Got the trees. Well, let's hope the meteors don't mess with them. Alright, go get them. Have at them, boys. Well, it happens. You see, it's about launching the rocket. It's not so much about it going up. The launch is what attracts the Predator asteroids. I didn't launch the second rocket, though. We must free our creatures. in the middle of the lake, the lake strat. Mm. I mean, we could just create a launch pad on the lake as well. All right, another round.
We need to find some silicon. You know what? We're just gonna go into the lake. See how that does. Go up. Jet, you have a jet pack, bro. Hmm. Just being finicky about it. It's my lake house. What am I supposed to do with that? Okay, you can technically activate the pack while you're in the, uh, in the water, which is kind of an awkward. <laughs> okay, let's see, can I? I think you need to be near the edge to drink. Oh wait, I got one in. Mm, oh, there they are. Yeah, pretty good. Pro gamer asteroid hunting. Yeah, it looks like they all just, like, while it'll hit on the edge, they'll drop down to the nearest non-rock area. food Looks like there's some over there. The thing about this is like, it depends on the mood. Like, I like this to mix it up, but also I like getting in the routine of like, what I'm working on. It's almost annoying to have to, even though this is quicker, it's almost annoying to have to like, go out and look for it. My exploring days are, are over. Though, I think this is more efficient. The rocket-based iridium drops, on top of the fact they do add to your, uh, the pressure levels as well. And the iridium does not despawn, right? Like, I could have just never touched all this and I could keep... Like, it'll be there until I pick it up.
Yeah, and eventually the meteors... Honestly, maybe that's the strat. Launch the rockets, drag them down, and then don't bother with it for a while. So, the rain is FPS killing on these settings. The only downside is you do have to be. Well, let's let's check the numbers real quick. Do -do -do. So that those were pressure rockets. Yeah, it doesn't actually do that much. Specifically for that. Can you just make the the launch pad on the lake, or do you need foundations? Have it along the end. We'll give it a shot. Nope, wrong way. Another upside of rockets is not requiring additional energy. Somehow. I guess yeah, you built it into the rocket. I have it back by the wreck on the hill. So you're saying all the asteroids will hit. I wonder if you put it, like, really far away. Didn't I have some super alloy somewhere? <laughs> on the platform? Well, it's in the forest now. Is there anything left to be discovered? I have it on good authority, and that by that I mean I did look at a map. There are a couple more bunkers out there that I have yet to see. I don't know who they were built by, but there are secret bunkers of this of the variety that uh, we found Xiaodans. How many gold chests? I found a lot of them, but not all. Right, we can we can build space command now where we'll store our rocket no I've I've found like 10 I think they're like 15 or something according to once again the mapping techno wait can I just is there any anything stopping me from building right where the rocket spawns besides probably ruining the rocket some more doesn't appear there is. All right, so here we are. A glass roof to see the rocket. Well, I still have to launch it from the pad. Was the issue. I mean, this can be my meteor house. Just chilling there. I mean, I don't know what you would be doing, but. If you watch the map screen, you can see all the rockets land. 
Oh, so I gotta put a map screen in, in command. Alright. You mean the meteors land, not the rockets? Uh, I shouldn't be able to see in there. <laughs> I do have, like, the second level GPS satellite, so... The forest is really coming together. Jesus. It is quite an exponential. Okay. Are you prepared to go all the way? I am prepared. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we gotta... <laughs> Mm, all right. <laughs> I'm going to need more super alloy over there. You have to try multiple at once. We're gonna try six at once. We're almost to the end of the depot. So, each rocket is two super alloy. If I'm doing six, I need 12. So, why do I have an odd number of inventory spaces? Why do you do this? I'm just gonna have to pick up a silicon. Well, you know where the rocket engines go. Take an engine from the pile. All right. Actually, we'll put the first one on the pad. <laughs> well, I don't know what I expected. <laughs> well, Houston? Well, Houston can't hear shit, but we, we do have a bit of an issue here. 
Um, hmm. I need an alternative door. Well, take me with you. Oh, I can't get to the fucking locker. Well, that seems like a rocket-based bridge will cross when we come to it. All right. Fire everything! a little off course. I went to the other side. Ah, I gotta go be in the lake while this is happening. I forgot. Hit me! I don't want to land too high either. No, I need to be as deep as possible. Ooh, what's that? Look at those pretty colors. Wait, no, that's, that's nothing. I think that might be something. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Pretty intense. But look. Pretty sure that's just the distortion of the sound maxing out. Is the quote hit mark sound? You just watched too many mimi memes. That's what, that's where you're getting that from. The maximum distortion. I wonder if you built enough. I wonder if they hit the foundations. Rolling down. We hit a hundred terraforming index, by the way. Oh shit, it hit the heaters! Oh fuck! So it does hit the foundations.
looks like it's doing some real damage from down here. And then you go up, it's fine, but... Space food... Squash seeds. Done? I don't think we're done. Give us another one! That was only like four, right? 